Yo guys, it's your boy Fabian, back again with another video and it's time for yet another Eurovision 2023 video and what we're going to be doing today, we're going to be looking at semi-final one and we're going to be doing our prediction but we're going to be doing it in the form of a tier list so, with the tier list, um, we're going to have three sections, I'll go through it in a bit but we're going to place those countries in semi-final one until we've got our final 10 going through to the final remember, it's my opinion, it's not a fact so listen, if you want to rip me in the comments, do what you got to do but remember, it's an opinion. But before we get into it, guys, make sure you subscribe down below, press the bell notification button down below so you can be the first to know when I upload. I have reacted to every single entry to this year's Eurovision, so make sure you check those out after you're done with this video. But let's crack on with the video. Semi-final one, Eurovision 2023 predictions. Let's go. Okay, guys, as you can see, we've got three sections here. We've got 100% in the final, we've got potentially in the final, and we've got absolutely no chance. So, um, yeah, it's just semi-final one. I know all the, the countries are there from this year's Eurovision, but we're doing semi-final one. I'll do semi-final two in another video. So, we're going to go through in terms of the list that's um, like the running order, essentially, for the semi-final. And we are going to start off with Croatia. Now, Croatia is let three, and for me, this is a shocking entry. I'll be completely honest with you. Um, listen, I'm, in my pers personal opinion, I'm putting this one in absolutely no chance, but I've got this sniggling feeling that somehow it could go through. Because for the semi final, there's no jury. So, listen, I don't know how he's going to get voted, but maybe the message, I don't know. But the fact that it's quirky, it's different. Um, but look, I just. It could be potentially a final, but I'm just gonna stick in absolutely no chance because, yeah, I, I, that's just gonna go with my gut instinct on that one. Then we've got Ireland, and um, Ireland was Wild Youth. And again, for me, this one, absolutely no chance. Um, I just don't see this one getting into the final. I'm sorry, guys. Also, I will say this, um, once I'm done with this semi-final, once I've put them in place, I might look at it and alter it just like, Listen, once it's all there in front of me, maybe I think I've got something wrong, I'll change it. But um, for now, that's going in absolutely no chance. Then we've got Latvia. And you know what? Latvia for me, um, where's Latvia? Latvia, again, is no chance. I just don't see like how this one gets through to the final. The start to this one was poor. And yeah, Southern Lights, listen, that chorus was decent, but the start to it was off key. I, I, I don't know. For me, it's absolutely no chance. And also, can I say, what a poor start to the um, first semi final. Um, then we've got Malta, and um, Malta, I'm going to put in. Where is Malta? Let's have a look. Malta. I'm putting this one potentially in the final. I think this one, not my cup of tea, and to be honest, I wouldn't send it to the final. Um, but I can see the public sending it to the final. So yeah, the Basque is representing Malta, and for me, I'm putting in potentially right now. Then we've got um, Norway, and that is Alessandra. And for me, this one is 100% in the final, no questions asked. I think this is one of the best entries in this year's Eurovision. Then we've got Mimikat, representing Portugal. And again, for me, this one is 100% in the final, no questions asked. I think it is, yeah, yeah, it's gonna be in the final, 100%. I don't need to talk much more about that one. Um, then we've got Serbia. And I'm gonna put Serbia. Um, I'm gonna put Serbia 100% in the final because it's not my cup of tea song-wise. I'm a bit disappointed with it, um, but I just think there'll be enough support behind it to get it to the final. So I do think that gets through to the final. Um, then we've got Azerbaijan, and for me, um, Azerbaijan. Where is Azerbaijan here? Um, for me. I'm going absolutely no chance for now. I just, I just, it's a disappointing song. Honestly, um, I just don't know what they were thinking with that one. It's, to be honest with you, it's one of the most boring songs this year. So, um, yeah, for me, absolutely no chance. Um, then we've got Czech Republic. Czech Republic, which is, yeah, best not. And look, for me, Czech Republic is 100% in the final. No questions asked. I think this is one of the best entries this year. The chorus, incredible. So, uh, yeah definitely going through to the final then we've got Finland and listen for me this is one of the favorites to win it so this one a million percent in the final no questions asked so yeah carry up with Finland don't even have to worry about it um, 
then we have Israel again I think Israel is 100% in the final very good entry by Noah Kiro I really like this one I do like this one I think it's got a bit of something for everyone so um, yeah 100% in the final then we have Moldova which is Pasha Parfeni Moldova where is it again for me 100% in the final I really like this one I think everyone's gonna really enjoy this one so um, yeah nice vibe with this definitely in the final then we've got Netherlands which is Mia Nikolai and Dion Cooper and again with the Netherlands if I can just find it where is it Netherlands again 100% in the final for me very nice song and it could be a sneaky one to win it one to watch then we have the last two countries Sweden and Switzerland and look Laureen I think it's the favorite to win it and I think if I'm being honest I think they do win it but um, yeah 100% in the final no question asked then we have Switzerland Remo Fora and this one I'm gonna put in I'm putting 100% in the final but you know what I'm putting it in potentially in the final right now and how many countries have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we've got one spot left. And I think that one spot is going to be between Malta and Switzerland. I'm going to give it to Switzerland. I think Switzerland, for me, um, has just enough. It's a, it's a good song. I'm, I'm in two minds just because some people weren't too sure about the message coming from Switzerland. So, um, yeah, for me, I like the song, just worried about the message. But look, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got a final ten from the first semi-final, guys. So look, for me, um, I wouldn't change anything there if I'm being completely honest. So what we have going through to the final from semi-final one in Eurovision 2023: Norway, Portugal, Serbia, Czech Republic, Finland, Israel, Moldova, Netherlands, Sweden, and Switzerland. That's our ten. Let me know in the comments below guys, do you agree, do you disagree, would you change anything here? Um, let me know in the comments below. Um, I don't think this, this one is too debatable if I'm being completely honest with you, but look, maybe someone wants a Malta in there, who knows? Let me know in the comments below. But I'm going to end the video there guys, so um, yeah, hope you enjoyed this prediction. Make sure you check out all the reactions I've done. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment below some more suggestions. I'll try to check out you guys as always. But I'm gonna have to love you and leave you. So thanks for watching. Keep yourself safe out there. Have a good day. Have a good evening. And until next time, guys, I hope you have a good one.